I swear every time I see Token, he has bag ear and bag ear clothes. <laughs> One, play. All right. I didn't spend no extra money on my dad's casket. Just that shitty piece of wood, I saw the back cracking. I brought a girl to his funeral, dress was tightly fit, ass poking out the back, distracting my uncles and shit. Jesus Christ, bro. You can't be saying that. No matter how true that is, you can't be saying that, bro. What the f Dress was tightly fit, ass poking out the back, distracting my uncles and shit. But knowing my dad, I really didn't mind that I wanted to fuck her inside the bathroom, but my mom was by it. She expensive, but she fucked me for the free pops. So tonight we both flying inside a cheap box, treetops. Sip below my shaded window, cause of my amazing lingo. Bitch, this house so big is probably getting fat shamed by the neighbor's cribbo. Just the same as Lizzo Dog is plain and simple. They used to ride around with seniority like state officials. Now they They used to ride around with seniority like state officials. And the whole like Lizzo. Oh my god. I'm not even gonna repeat all of that. This guy is talking disrespectful today. Like every line has been pretty disrespectful so far. Plain and simple. They used to ride around with seniority like state officials. Now they're bending over backwards for me. It's like a game of limbo. I get so many bottles for free. I got to invite the entire gang to drink those. Even my two lawyers, Jake and Mitchell. Three Jews walk into a bar. Sound like a racist riddle. No matter how wild they get, you can still train a pit bull. But you're in a Civic with the window cracked. There ain't no way to flip that. She want to take the kid back. She hit the gym harder than me. She got a crazy six pack, but would risk it all to put a baby in that. I don't want no kid, but I know being in my PM. W like the same company. Okay. That painted my Okay, I like that. The biggest gift my father gave me didn't come in no crazy gift wrap. But the fact that more often than not, he canceled on our plans. The gift he gave me was the lesson to never rely on another man. My life ain't that's hard to hear. The actual lesson I learned from that was to never rely on other and on another man. And for to say that your own dad taught you that lesson is shit, man. That's tough. And not he canceled on our plans. The gift he gave me was the lesson to never rely on another man. My life ain't too wild, but it's nothing bland. And I lie, but I understand. If you've never been wired, a hundred grand. She talks to get violent with fuck the plans, but I like her enough to dance. I just gotta accept the tax. She remind me of Uncle Sam. Speaking of tax. Tax, like taxes, Uncle Sam, but a tax. Okay. 300 flat. When I was 19 and a half, still finished your class. Every bathroom stall in school, we put token stickers in that. They used to scratch them off like lottery tickets. Turns out I'm the one who's lottery hitting. Move. My dogs keep trickling. My problems keep mimicking it, so my bottles be finished. Liquor stores at every corner on my brain like a neighborhood that's poverty stricken. Because my life is stressful, but I'm blessed, so it's not to be switched with. Oh my Gotta God. Be different. She is my muse. I'm the musician. Big attitudes like Jersey Shore, but they Hollywood women. Okay. I never wife the bitch like Ron. I just rendezvous with them. Got a new system. I find my type and I just stick with that. That's why I keep the same hoodie. It just keep me relaxed. 1400 for the- Keep the same hoodie. It keeps me relaxed, but the it's a relaxed fit too. Bag like I, I mentioned that at the start, right? Uh, very baggy, baggy clothing. So it keeps them relaxed because it's it's a relaxed fit. This one and I got four of them. Girls keep finding each other's hairs on them, so I need more of them. I went to middle school in a rich town, so I was poor to one. Wasn't even poor, but finding who's the poorest was important to one. Pouring a cup of vodka out of ah. bottle, then I filled it with water. That was me at age 11. Just imagine what I've evolved to. I was a YouTube kid during a SoundCloud era. Most of my peers use visuals to make their styles. Press that like button right now. Sound better. I was in the same boat. The difference is my music mattered. I never dissed a new school rapper. I never thought about who rap faster. I just let the narrative be whatever the narrative is. I can't control it like I couldn't control my parents and shit. And while I wish they needed less medication and more love, it is what it is. And we're fortunate as fuck. Goldie, never too different. Yo. That was very real shocking disrespectful but the flows were there here's some elements of my past here's some elements of how it's shaped me in the present and how it's gonna affect me in the future very introspective again and i think that not a lot of people give enough credit to token for for that part right i feel like not enough people talk about how vulnerable he is on his tracks sometimes and and sometimes it's just like him talking shit for like half the song but he'll have one bar if you're actually paying attention you're like oh crap like that bar is so deep and he let us see some of that right 